Gareth Hobson trying to get up the rail and ran out of room there. And Stradivarius drives away to win his fifth cup. But it may not end there. Their favourite, Lati Dar, is only third. Magical is driven right out from Coronet. And magical for the win in the Phillies and theirs. Fitzroy is doing best of the rest on the run to the line, but it's Echo who prevails for Colm Donlan, Harry Cobden and Paul Nichols. Progressing all the time. He, 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 you know, he'd go on any ground and uh, he'd certainly get a bit further as well. So, um, yeah, he's uh, it's an exciting novice for the season. But it's Nicholson who's pulling two to three lengths clear and he's going to make a successful hurdles debut in the colours of Tim Sider for Richard Johnson, Ollie Murphy. It's, uh, it's a long season for these horses. If you have them 100% uh, ready in, in, in October and uh, hopefully he's going to be contesting better race than this in the not too distant future. Sebastopol a little bit slow away, but he's well in command here. And Sebastopol, still relatively unexposed over hurdles, going to win for Nico de Boinville, Tom Lacey and Mr. Baldy Brooks. Yeah, we've always held him in very high regard, so we'd like to think he, he could potentially be you know, great, great quality and have a go at one of those later on. Into the final 100 yards, it's Attention Seeker in the hands of Lee Cosgrove, another winner for Tim Easterby, as Attention Seeker wins with plenty in hand.